All right, here we are back on similes and metaphors. We're going to do another journal entry to kind of review these two again. Hopefully, you've watched the review video that I posted right before this journal entry so that you have that background knowledge again before we start doing this. Okay, we didn't do too hot on our quiz that we had with similes and metaphors and figurative language, so it's so important that we go back over it and make sure that we're totally understanding these correctly. Okay, guys, so you're going to need a red and a blue um, crayon or colored pencil. I don't care which one, but it has to be red or blue. You're going to need scissors. You're going to need this sheet, the simile metaphor sheet, which is either at the front table or at your group table that you're at. And you're going to need a glue. Now, I am using um, stick glue, but you know that I would rather you use liquid glue. So please, please, please use liquid glue and not stick glue. You can find it on the back counter or it'll be at your group table. So that is everything that you need to begin. Okay, so this is our finished colored page. See, my metaphors are red and my similes are blue. I want to go over this really fast before we cut. So for a metaphor, um, it says, I like to swim, I'm a duck. Okay? So it has the word like in it, but it's not saying you walk like a duck. It just says, I like to swim. It's talking about him liking to swim. Okay? So it's a metaphor because it's comparing... I, that person, to a duck, but it's not saying that she swims like a duck. It's just saying, I like to swim, I'm a duck. Okay, it's two different sentences, so they're not using like in one sentence to compare. I wanted to make sure I used an example that still had like, um, so you understood just because it has like, it's not a simile. You need to see if it's comparing them in the same sentence. Okay, now if you go look at our simile one, it says, well, you do walk like one. Okay, that's all one sentence. It's using like. So that's the same thing as saying um, you swim like a duck. Okay, that would all be one sentence using like. These are two sentences, so it makes it a metaphor. Okay, so one sentence with like, simile. Two sentences with like, but still comparing two things is a metaphor. Okay, we're going to do our definitions here in a second too. But I wanted to show you that you can still have like in a sentence and it not be a simile, okay? These are comparing two things, two different sentences, but that's a metaphor, okay? So the next thing that you're gonna do is you are going to cut out your metaphor and simile, 
boxes up at the top and you're going to cut out this squiggly box right here. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and do it and I'm going to show you the finished product. Okay.